have jumped over. I mean, honestly, man, door like a fancy door used to be like six, eight hundred bucks, maybe like, un- but under a grand. Now doors are like three grand. Marvin, but um, one thing I will say about doors, uh, go to like a builder surplus. They have a builder surplus. Now, builder surplus will have one off if your house can handle it. Make sure it doesn't clash with the existing windows that you have. I would try to find something that matches an Anderson or a Marvin for three digits, you know. But uh, if you do like a full custom, it's going to be twenty five hundred at least um, with everything. But if you can find something uh, used that was once three grand for two hundred and fifty to four hundred bucks on Facebook Marketplace, that's a good way to do it. Just make sure it doesn't clash with your other windows too too hard. Um, and if there's a set where you could do a patio door, I got lucky twice. I put two nine foot Pella doors with uh, three multi point locks, which is like a show you multi point lock yeah so it's like this thing like uh pillow doors multi, like side side of the door like like kind of i don't know the fucking the fancier doors but full glass ones like these but um mm. these are like they're like three grand i found them for 200 bucks at a fucking surplus house two black ones Nine feet tall, glass. Mm-hmm. Um, and I didn't get so lucky when I did the garage. I had to buy shitty ones. I'm pissed about it. Don't ever buy cheap doors. They suck. Cheap doors are cheap and they suck. Don't do it. I'm so fucking sad. I wish I would have uh, pawned something to when I ran out of money. But um, yeah, I would look at a builder surplus or a bargain outlet or something like that. Try to find a place that... There's, there's, there's some in Eastern Connecticut. I know there are. I would drive and get them. Um, you'll find one. But again, just think about shit that will clash. Uh, note um, on this house. 